look like it's gonna be that big, so we'll be driving right through it here. We're up in Georgia. Our, uh, I never updated last night. We were trying to escape from Texas. Saying I wanted to get down to, I wanted to get to the Welcome Center in Alabama on I-10 East. I had enough time to make it. I just hit hit a wall, man. I was tired. I just just was like, I got about two hours left, and and I was going, and I was like, oh, I can make it. And I got about an hour and a half left, and I was like, I can't do this. This is a not worth it even though I want to get this I want to get this thing delivered I want to get this offloaded so I can get this in for payday I was like I, I, I ain't worth it man so we pulled off over in Mississippi that's probably about 80 miles from the Alabama Welcome Center got up this morning continued on Right now I got about 92 miles to deliver. We're on the I-85 North in Georgia. We gotta get on the 285 and get around and head up on it's just right off right off the outskirts of 285, so it won't be that bad. It's looking like I should be there before five. They said, you know, it was one of those it has to be delivered today between 8 and 5 or tomorrow 8 to 5 and if I delivered it tomorrow you know first thing in the morning you know she probably still would put it on my pay but I've been doing that a lot here lately so like if I can get this thing offloaded today you know I should at least do that so we're tracking good you know I, I make it slow down just a little bit once I get on the bypass in Atlanta but it, it shouldn't be no big deal We'll still be there before five o'clock unless something crazy oh my gosh what's going on down there but, uh, oh here we go all in all been a good day except for the rain <laughs> i've been turning my like i got my elds on the ipad and I've been turning it off here, trying to turn it off. And I just don't want to. I'm always like, how much time do I got? How much time do I got? It's like, sometimes I just got to turn it off. Just, I know I'm not going to run out of time. We stopped at the uh, TA in Grand Bay, Alabama, and got some fuel. And I ended up doing like a, a, a you know, we only drove like an hour and 15 minutes. So I was like, yeah, I'll just do like another half. I'll do another half hour break there and I know you know he said it was right at six hours to get to where I'm going you know and I have the eight hours so I know I'm fine we'll just take a peek at it real quick I got three hours and 51 minutes so I'm good off with you so we'll just turn it back off We're gonna look for a load for this afternoon after we get off unloaded, but man, I'm just, I'm just tired. So we're just gonna get this thing offloaded, and find somewhere to hang out for the night, get us a dinner, get us a shower, and see what we can try to come up with tomorrow morning. I didn't want to go too far crazy, cause uh, Father's Day is this Sunday. I want to be home, you know, Friday or Saturday. I can be home Saturday, Sunday, Monday, come back out on Tuesday. Be glad to get all this tortilla mix off my trailer, man. 41,000 pounds. We'll catch up to you guys when we get there. You know what the plan is. Oh yeah, this
this ought to be good. I was looking at the Google Maps to where we got to deliver. I'm hoping I can maybe turn around inside there. Because the Google Maps wasn't looking too promising. It looks like it may be a possible blind side. So that'll be fun. So we'll see what happens. Let's get on down the road. We got 88 miles to go. Let's go. Alright, so good thing we made it. Good thing we're here. Good thing they're going to get us unloaded. Bad thing. Blind side off the street. Now I got to get into that last dock where that truck is. But he said I can just kind of sit off to the side. Then when he's done, I can get inside there. So. Gotta love it. And I doubt this traffic is gonna stop for me, so you gotta work around that crap. got to be a point where that's it no one's no one else is getting through and this is it right here try to turn the window a little bit Heavy load uphill, blind side, gotta love it. Just take her easy. Who cares how long it takes? Probably gonna probably pull up on this curb. This sidewalk right here. So far, so good. All right, I think we're good. Come on, dude. Golly, people. Truck, what's that? Look 
gonna do it again. <laughs> I should have just waited on the street. Don't give me a lot of room. Let me go open these doors. Ups here. Not exactly what you expected to do in the when you woke up this morning. <laughs> neutral it's on like a slope and it wants to break on you I think I should be good Why are you beeping at me? Alright, let me go see if I'm good. Oh yeah, I think we're good. see what happens I think we're good I mean I could pull up one more time but why risk it 